Hey guys, welcome back. So today I wanted to share a small tip with you guys and uh, this is like the problem that I faced uh, over a decade or for now. So how do you deal when a developer is not accepting your defect? Some of the developers, I don't know why, but they feel offended when a defect is assigned to, by, to their name. So it, 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 it is not with all of them. Some of them are really friendly. Most of them are very friendly. But some of them are like that, where they, wherein they never accept a defect and they say that it's not reproducible and they don't fix the defect. It will be open like forever. And uh, I came up with a solution like this. This is how I deal when a developer is behaving like this. So what I do is I uh, schedule a meeting with my product team. I involve my business analyst, product team and the developer. Like generally I have my QA triage meetings or the weekly status calls, QA weekly status calls. So I discuss this, I bring this up in that meeting and I share my screen to all of them and I explain them the actual behavior, how it is behaving in my SIT region. And now I ask them a business team whether that is expected. If I have any question without any doubt, I'll bring this up and ask them straight away whether this is expected if they say that is expected i'm good too like you know my motto is to get that resolved and you know make sure that it's working as expected so i'll take it back if i say that that is not expected that's when as a developer is also involved in the call i'll tell him to fix that defect immediately so in case sometimes if the product team is too busy and they can't attend your meetings that's when you send an email to the product team asking them to confirm whether the behavior that you see in sid is correct so mark also your developer in the same mail so that he'll be on the same page and uh, once you get back once you hear back from your product team and address the same thing like you know if, if they say that it's not expected your developer you can follow up with your developer and get this corrected it's always like this when either you or the developer like you know when the developer is saying that it's not reproducible or you know it's how it is expected like this is what is expected behavior and if you're not convinced with what he's saying it is always our responsibility to get back follow up with the business team and get that corrected it is always like this either you might be wrong or he might be wrong someone of you might have misunderstood the requirement so get it clear with the product team and uh, never take back the defect just because the developer says it's not reproducible usable and if you are not 100% convinced never ever take back the defect always get this resolved with your product teams i hope this tip helps you guys thank you bye bye talk to you soon